What's up guys and welcome back to another episode of Fishing Gin Milligan. We're out here today in the lower Laguna Madre. We have traveled south out of the Arroyo City area and uh, we're out here with some really awesome people today. Number one, my favorite person in the world, my wife, Mrs. Fishing Gin Milligan, and she is probably going to catch more fish than both of us combined. Speaking of both of us, I'm here with my buddy Ruben. He's out here with us and we have a beautiful day and he is a media drone picture captioning extraordinaire and we're gonna get some awesome shots of this really cool lower laguna madre and hopefully catch some fish too with murky water rods you guys stay tuned fish get million out let's go no skunk <laughs> Um, there we go. Oh wait, no, you let it go. There we go. Yeah, we're both on like a reddish. There's another one. There you go, babe. Nice. There you go. Chiquito, pero picoso. Mm, nice one. That is a pretty one. A lot of specks on it. All right, guys. Another one on the OG Blood Diamond. The next cast too. That's a lot of stuff. Pretty fish, a lot of spots. Bye, little guy. <laughs> no way! You must have got on some sort of like. Nicole, you're an official member. You're welcome on board. <laughs> Thanks. All right, babe. Uh, you can do that one. I'm gonna catch one real quick. I know, right? Three in a row. Three. Good job, babe. Three for three. Three for three. Three in a row. That was as soon as it hit the water too. Did you steal my spot? I did. <laughs> what are you gonna do about it? <laughs> Sorry babe, I got content to make. Yeah. I'm gonna start using my wife as a tax write-off. She's on the channel and she bought a purse the other day. I gotta make her happy. Tax write-off. It's not a purse, it is a newer owner. <laughs> <laughs> upscale lure holder. Yeah, upscale lure holder. <laughs> Bougie edition. I want to catch some of this color loco. What color is it? Oh yeah, yeah. Jacob said he was gonna give me some of those. Uh they look pretty good. Yeah. Well, I'm gonna see if I can catch one on this one because I told Jacob I'm gonna try it out. All right, babe, let us in on the seeker. How are you fishing it today? Well, I was, I was fishing in that spot. Yeah, and then what happened? And then my husband got jealous. Okay, and then? And then I stopped catching. <laughs> he said, gentlemen, smellin'. Gentlemen, smellin'. <laughs> hey, I'm letting you use my rod. Yeah, I re oh, you caught another one oh, as soon as you go in there? What? <laughs> she catches a little. Oh, she let go. He let go before we have real issues. <laughs> <laughs> wow, babe. What is going on? Marriage counseling? Yeah. What you <laughs> How much is it? $300. 300 How can we not have a golf between us with a tone like that? It's, it's not me. It's, it's, it's not, not me, it's the, me. it's not me, it's the lure, guys. I guess so, man. Yeah. Oh, you're shooting red too, though, right? Yeah, it's like a greenish red, I guess. That's more of like a red and white. Pink. With a pink head. So maybe it's more of the white, maybe it's red, I don't know. Maybe it's both. It's not the plane, it's the pilot. And you get like someone else being like, there it is. How did that make you feel? <laughs> Alright guys, first ever fish on a K Wiggler. This is a new deal for me. Never caught one guys. And he got it down deep too. Yeah, no skunk. My wife let me catch one guys. Nicole, you would get along really well with my wife. Same. So this guy did this to me. And uh, so I took it personal. And then uh, he just goes out there and destroys them on the basketball court. Yeah. And I feel like that's a, that's our wife sometimes. They're like, you know what? I took it personal. <laughs> and then I just, I just decided to show them up. 
So the way he hit, I just felt my rod go like that. And then I just reeled in and just sideswiped him. Yeah, work it slower, man, because they're they're eating, but they seem a little lethargic. Which, if they have been eating all night, and this is their, their time to kind of finally kick it back up. I typically go to the Willow Tail. Really? Maybe I should try that. It just, it, just, it, it almost like, it reminds me a lot of a corky, especially with like a 1.8. Uh-huh. No. Oh, no. My husband tied this and sabotaged me. <laughs> Well, you caught a few fish on it, though. Yeah, you I'm can fish. I'm good at the knot. You can fish with this one for right now. So the cool thing about her is she can just go to a bait caster like no big deal. Really. Well, yes, really. So you want a different color, right, babe? You want to try something just totally crazy different? <laughs> She's like, sure. I don't want to catch fish today. So you would think, you would think oh, she oh, she lets that. me. You would think she lets me catch fish. And I beat her. Fish on your rod. I know. <laughs> Guys, I'm trying to rig up her stuff that broke because she doesn't know how to tie. Oh, <laughs> yes, she she's not that good. And she's over here, guys. She's catching on my stuff. Look at this. Murky water rot. Thank you, Jacob, for letting me borrow it. It's sickness. Uh, and here she is catching on my Kelly Wiggler lure. Look at that, guys. That, go that went down deep. Ah, there it is, guys. That's olive with red fleck. And that is a huge trout, uh, probably about 25 guys, 25 centimeters that is. There it is. So what actually happened is guys, I tied a bad knot for her. So now I'm having to retie. This is what I get for misbehaving. I remember last night you said, oh, did I cut the wrong thing? And they're like, no, it's mine. Yeah, probably. I probably nicked it. All right guys, I'm tying this back on for her. Salty head 3 16th loop knot with the OG blood diamond. And she's throwing this on the murky water rod seven foot light action if you guys want to check out murky water rods call up jacob Bettis down in the description below i got his number make sure to reach out to him he's doing custom rods starting at 169 i believe that's true oh that's a bite so the other thing I've heard too, man, is that people say, oh, you're catching small trout, you need to move spots. But what they say is that the small trout feed first and the bigger trout come in later. Oh, so really? just cause you're on some small trout, like right now we're catching everything probably less than 16, but it doesn't mean move. It means kind of wait. Now don't wait forever, but feel it out and see if you start catching some bigger ones then maybe stick around a little bit more. What's that over there? Are those reds? Yeah, looks like red. That's dolphin, isn't it? No, I was told it's small. What is that? It. No, it is oh, a dolphin. It is a dolphin. Uh-oh. Well, that means it's after some reds. Baby dolphin. Yeah. After reds or maybe some trout. Probably spooking the crap out of all the fish right now. Oh, you got one? Yeah. Sweet. There you go, babe. Wow, look at that. Ooh. Look, he's coming, babe. He's coming. For me? Yes. Oh, Get no. him out of the water. Get him out of the water. <laughs> nice trout. I got it, babe. I got it. Oh, shoot. That's a nice trout. Holy cow. There you go. <laughs> look, the dolphin took off. Oh, right there. Woo. That. All right, guys. I'm. Ah, oh, he's biting me. <laughs> Why'd right. you put your finger in his mouth? I don't mouth? know. I don't know. No. Oh, no he's, he's still on. He's still on. He's still on. I don't know. I never do that. <laughs> <laughs> so smart. Hold a trout like this, guys. I don't know why I did that. All right, I got it. Yeah. Is this still going? Yeah. All right guys, OG Blood Diamond with the salty head and she caught herself a nice trout. Look at that thing right there. Can you put your rod up? Oh, that one. 
There it is. I can't put it up because the fish put it down. Dang it, girl. <laughs> Alright, let's go home. Tell me about it. <laughs> oh, you foul hooked it. Yeah, yeah. he foul grabbed it. Okay, let me let me get it so he doesn't hurt himself. Oh, let it go. Okay, that's better. Mess him up. <laughs> yeah, it's time to go. It's time to go to the rig. I think I'm gonna switch to Otra. Oh gosh, here we go. Okay, she's not coming on Saturday, bro. She's already humiliated us too much. Okay, babe, I tried to play fair. But, uh. But you can't. We're not playing fair anymore. It's game over. Yeah, go to this Laguna Plage. That's true. We would do better with like the wind blown area. Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay. You like do like a redrift further that way, and if it does something great, and if not, then we'll just bug out. Oh, sweet. Yeah, yeah. There's one Ruben. Right on cue, Ruben. Ooh, that's a good one too, Ruben. On the Laguna Plage, guys, let's go. Look at that, bro. <laughs> That's sick right there. All right, guys. Kelly Wiggler, Laguna Flage, down in the gullet. Look at this thing right here. Let's go. That is a, that is a stud trout right there. Sheesh. Super nice. Got one? Yes, sir. There you go. Little trout. There you go, bro. I got you. I got you. All right, guys. Yes, ma'am. <laughs> I don't know, man. I don't know. Bro. Where she's All right, guys. <laughs> I don't know what she's talking about. Mansfield Margarita, guys. K Wigglers. Nice little trout. He's probably about. 15? What do you think? I don't know if he'll keep, but... He's a Thanksgiving 15, bro. Yeah, Thanksgiving 15. No skunk, yeah. No skunk. <laughs> yeah, there we go. Yeah. Told you I gave you the right lure, babe. Yeah. Told you I gave you the right lure. Hey, don't pee on me, dog. Don't be peeing on me. Sheesh. Oh, there it is. You did have a baby trout. There you go. You can hear him grunting, a little male. Yeah, I got you. There you go. All right, guys, another little John, the little guy. Bye-bye. Alright guys, if you don't catch them, it's all good. You can always fish again.